Hello everybody, welcome to Bayonetta here at Hideki Kamiya Park. Please keep your arms and legs inside the vehicle as this ride contains thrills and a not very nonsensical storyline. Let's go. Oh god, I'm overflowing! Oh, whoops. <laughs> you don't want to continue, yes. Good job. You already fucked up. I did. Uh, playing Bayonetta. Uh, I'm drinking. Uh, so am I. Uh, PS3 version, but we've already installed it, so we're not going to have the uh, 50 second... 50 second uh, loading times for pausing. Yeah, that was an issue when it first came out. So, right now, uh, my game experience, I've gotten to chapter 6, and I think there's 16 chapters. So you're saying that, once again, you're a big fat phony. I never said I beat it. This guy's a phony. So, we got uh, right now we got normal mode, but normal's pretty rough, so they have an easy mode. And easy's actually also pretty rough, so they have a very easy mode. Very easy is actually horrible. It's Better. worse than uh, very hard. But we're going to do normal because that's going to be the most fun, and I will die a lot. And we all like dying, especially when it's him. Well, so now we, we go through see these strands of DNA. There's some, uh, there's some pretty quick deaths in this series, in this game, I should say. It's not a series yet. Quick, what does DNA stand for? D I O. I used to know, too. Nucleic. Acid is dinosaur nucleic acid, you are correct. <laughs> it's not dinosaur, I can tell you that. It's diox, di uh, di Yeah, I, I can't remember the first word. I can never remember it either. That's why I like dinosaur nucleic acid. Alright, so, uh, di 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 basic di storyline, clan of witches, most have been killed. There are very few left. Also, angels. Fight angels for some reason. Because, why not? Yeah. Long since erased from the records of time. There once existed two European is this the Joe Pesci voice? This is not the Joe Pesci voice. The two European clans who served the overseers in history. The Umbra witches, dwellers of the darkness. Hey, Marv. Marv. You got the, you clogging the pipes, Nav? Narv? Marv? Marv. M-A-H-V. This kid. So, this is not the prologue, but it's, it's before the pro It's the pre-prologue. Wow, you just completely blew my mind. <laughs> yeah, there's a, there's an actual prologue that'll happen after we stop fighting these angels on the clock. Oh, oh, that is a because it <laughs> that's a strong brick. Yep, just the way I like it. But once on you know what would have been awesome if the clock said 10:04, because that's when lightning hit the clock tower in the future. Other. Uh, you were close by being not close at all. No, that looks like 11.26 to me. Uh, actually, we're on the opposite end, I think. Because look at the window above it. The arcs. So, uh, So, 7 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 5 o'clock. It's like about 7 o'clock. Fight the tremendous radiance of God shining upon them. No, it's like 10 till 5. 5 till 5. By the assault the We're debating the clock while we just fight angels. While no, no, no. I'm debating the clock while you're dying. Big difference. I ain't dying yet. Actually, can you die here? I don't think you can on this part. Hey, look. Here. That's not going to be a theme later on in this game. Not at all. While I myself have not played this game, I know the premise of... Well, I don't want to say the premise, but I know... The hair monsters? Well, I know that her hair is, like, her suit and... And there's some of her hair right there. Yes. Like, the more damage she gets, the less hair and makes it more... Uh, it's her combo meter, kind of. Like, when you start losing the hair, that yeah, means your combo's about finished. And you have to have a little few split second. Well, I thought, like, health is dry. Like, the lower oh, no, health you, you get, the... Now you have a health bar. Right, I know, but I'm saying... The, the less health you have, the more clothing is revealed or something. I don't think so. I, uh, I haven't really been paying attention as much to my self as I am the enemy. When, I'm at, the, when I'm at that low. It, it's really hard to see stuff. <laughs> Honestly. Because there's so much shit flying at you in this game. <laughs> Of course they have guns too. Oh, hey, they have what are you doing, Princess Leia? Let's go. Just stay close to me. <laughs> I was gonna say there's plenty, plenty of guns. 
That's like really high up. If you were falling for like a few minutes. Well, no, no, it's not even that. It, witches has nothing to do with heights. I just, you were falling for a long hmm. time. <laughs> Artistic license. It's Kamiya. Hey, look, you, B11 scavenger. Bingo. <laughs> Alright, so now the Buffalo of Blood. Man, sometimes you get that at Buffalo Wild Wings. Yeah, it, it's not great. Hey, look, it's an angel plane. Ah, <laughs> oh, the Ku Klux Klan has arrived. Uh, I hate it when they ha I hate it when they show up. I hate it when they happen. <laughs> <laughs> you know, they're just having a good picnic. They're like, oh, the Klan. Yeah. Great. Well, let's pack up uh, our food. Excuse me, uh, we reserved Gazebo 7? Uh, why are... <laughs> Why is the KKK in our gazebo? Because K is the seventh letter of the alphabet. Oh. Ritualistic suicide. Never mind. Oh. Uh, we're good. Uh, just get the mop and we'll continue. I, mean, for someone, I was waiting for you to call me out on that whole seventh letter thing. This is totally G. I didn't even hear you say anything. Oh, I dropped my booze on myself. Good job. Okay, now we start the prologue. The vestibule. Vestibule. Vest. Ibule. Vestibuli. Follow your nose. Follow your nose. Follow your nose. I'm Joe Pesci. We're going to the vestibule. Vestibule. We meet Joe Pesci in, I think, the next scene, so. That's why I'm very interested in this game. We're all for Joe Pesci. All for Joe Pesci. I don't think it's actually Joe Pesci. Fuck that, it's Joe Pesci to me now. Alright, I'll just put the, uh... Hey, I'm in, a, I'm in a graveyard! Alright, we can put the controller down for a while. This takes a little while. Why is there a developed team on a grave? Are they dead? Well, this is the remains of Clover Studios, so... Yeah, not, 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 not. <laughs> Truth. Oh man, I love this episode of Treehouse of Horror. Speaking of things horror related, I think down oh, yeah, the line. I was gonna say, it's October. Happy October, everyone. Yes, that's true. <laughs> one of these things I wanna do, one of these times I wanna play, uh If it's amnesia, I'm slapping you. No, it's not amnesia. There's enough amnesia let's plays out there. Or slender. No, it's not computer based. Even all Eggman the Destroyer gets scrambled in the end. Eggman the Destroyer, so now we're crossing over You're right. to it's Sega. Sonic. It's Sega. I still don't get why the hell you drag me well, out. Sega was the developer for this for some reason. There's Harry, and then there's Marv to the right. They're the hey, sticky bandits. Right, now they're the undead bandits. Marv, you have a nice butt. Reading the good Lord's book ain't gonna do much. <laughs> no, uh, Fatal Frame. Oh. Yeah. You, do, you have had that for a while, and I've only touched it. Now, I have on. gotten... Like decently far into it, but that was years upon years ago. It's still scary. I got lost and said, "Fuck it." <laughs> Japanese are good at that shit. Man, I want a bowler hat. That's, not dang that's dangerously close to drink material. Not, not to be confused with a fedora. <laughs> oh yeah, it's definitely a bowler hat. Now, what did you wear when you were the penguin you really at Halloween? Shit, top hat. Top hat. Oh, yeah. It was top hat. I was like, I knew you had a hat, but I couldn't remember. And I think Janice has it now, or someone threw it out. I don't know. It was way too small, but for it five bucks... It was box, way too small. For five bucks at a costume shop... I'll give you a hint. If it's most hats, it's way too small for you. That's true. I have a big head, ladies. I got my matches wet. Good job. My kids I'm trying to light one just for the heck of it. Cute He's got a cigar. I want. I want to help the guy out. Well, in the rain. Adios. Yeah, not working. The matches themselves aren't wet, but the light, the lighting strip, totally doused. Good job. Yeah, that's uh, that sounds a lot like Mr. Pesci. Yeah. Desecration. But they're there, ain't they? You hearing me? You you can see them, can't you? 
Yeah, normal humans can't uh, see the angel creatures. So basically, all Pesci is Pesci's just seeing the light and hearing the song. That sounds dangerously close to uh... <laughs> sirens. I mean, you can see them, but you hear their songs and then you die. Yeah, we read don't, a book! Read a book! We don't need the Bible anymore. That is not the Bible. That's too thin to be the Bible. Now she discos her way out of here. Yeah. Oh, I must go now! My planet needs me! Okay. That's taking blackface to a little extreme. <laughs> it's not blackface. It's, transi it's transitioning planes. Such a glorious touch. Oh god, why? <laughs> I'm at a loss of for words here. <laughs> it gets better. I think I know why I didn't like this game or watching it. Um, she's way too lanky. <laughs> she is a very, very non possible proportioned woman. <laughs> yes. Weird thing that, not to the point where I'm going to, to not believe any of this story material because clearly we're already <laughs> past that point. Oh yeah, that it, it's Kamiya. Yes. Kamiya, Kamiya, you, Kamiya and Suda Fifty One just throw all realism out the door the second you press on. Why did he get rid of his blackface? He looks so nice with it. And then Dante shows up. Not, Hey guys, Dante here. Such a lot blacker. And way more badass than Dante. You heard me. Because <laughs> he just smashed a coffin over his head. He didn't. It's, it's it, just, it, just it just fell over his head. I was like, whatever. some lore about him, I wouldn't be surprised if he's actually the devil, but I don't know. I know there's a book, there's a book you can get that's called, that's about Rodon, but I haven't read it yet. In, in the game, not an actual... Right, and now they do the human sense. No, they do the ultra suplex! <laughs> there is... I guess this is... God damn it, Kamiya. Fan service. <laughs> they go to her day, Kamiya's like, hey, we need a new strong female lead character. Kamiya does this scene and go, never mind. We'll go someone else. Also, how about some uh, pop synth Sinatra for you? Feels good for me. <laughs> Put a parental warning on this. They were long past parental <laughs> warnings here. Just saying. Crotch! Drink! Every suggestive shot. Take no, a drink. I'm going to die. Exactly. Hey, <laughs> brought up the has to be guns. There's a lot of guns. Also, this makes no goddamn sense. Really? I hadn't noticed. <laughs> I hadn't noticed that she can fucking fire a gun without pulling the goddamn trigger. I noticed that she seems to bend just the right places so that none of her gets hurt. No. This is... Drink! <laughs> She's not even aiming. She's just throwing them. She gets them. Look at my butt while I shoot. <laughs> I can tell you, you're out of uh, guns now. Drink. <laughs> Why is that in a coffin? I don't know. <laughs> well, <laughs> oh, Joe. 
four. Oh, that's a baseball swing. Never yeah, mind. I baseball. thought he was going to take a golf swing. <laughs> Sorry, I was like, I want to make witty commentary, but I'm just laughing. Even though I just saw this, like, I just replayed the opening of this, like, a week and a half ago, and I was still laughing just as much of how absurd this opening is. Oh god, I'm playing! Playing! Oh god, playing, playing, playing! Next episode, playing! <laughs>